Let's look at this problem related to geometry triangles. We have a triangle ADE in which we have been given that AB equals to BC, BC equals to CD, CD equals to DE, DE equals to EF, EF equals to FG and FG equals to GA. That is the information given to us and we have to find out what is the angle DAE. Now what is the concept we have to use to solve this particular problem related to triangles fundamentals. If you have a triangle then all the three angles of the triangle will add up to 180 degrees. Also, if two sides of a triangle are equal, then opposite angles are equal and the other one is the exterior angle of a triangle is equals to sum of two opposite interior angles. Let us take a small triangle XYZ to, to recap what we know about this. Let us take a small triangle XYZ and let us say the angles are 1, 2, 3. In this scenario, the concept what we are going to use to solve this problem is that angle 1 plus angle 2 plus angle 3 is equals to 180 degrees sum of all interior angles of a triangle sum up to is equal to 180 degrees and also exterior angle equals to sum of two opposite interior angles. Here you can see that angle 4 equals to angle 1 plus angle 2. And also if two sides are equal, let us say x y is equal to x z, then opposite angles are equal. That means angle 1 equals to angle 3. Now these properties we are going to use in this particular problem, these three concepts and we also know that at one particular point on a straight line all the angles will add up to 180 degrees. We can solve this so many different ways. One of the way I have tried, I am just trying to share that with you. So let us start first. Let us say what we need to find out is x that is angle DAE. Take triangle ABC, AB equals to BC. So angle A equals to angle C. Let us say that is equals to x and x. Now what will be the exterior angle CBD that will be x plus x to x. Now we also know that BC equals to CD. Now let us switch to triangle BCD. We have base angles are equal therefore angle CDB is also equals to 2x. Now let us do angle sum property on this triangle BCD. We get that angle BCD equals to 180 minus 4x. Now let us apply at particular point C that on a straight line all angles will add up to 180 degrees. We get angle DCE equals to 3x but we know CD equals to DE. That means angle CED is also equals to 3x. Now let us wait there and let us go back to the last condition given to us FG equals to GA. Since we started with angle DAE or angle GAF equals to X, we know FG equals to GA. So base angles are equal therefore angle GFA is also equal to X. Again, we can apply the exterior angle property and we can find out that angle FGE is equal to 2x. Let us switch to triangle GFE. We know base angles are equal there because we have GF equals to FG. We have EF equals to FG. That means the base angles are equal. So that gives us an idea that the angle CED which is 3x is divided into two parts 2x and x. Also let us do angle sum property and triangle CED. We have 3x, 3x, 6x. So left out angle CDE is equal to 180 minus 6x. So 
angle FDG is equal to 180 minus 4x. But if you take the triangle DEF and angle DEF equals to x, then what will be angle EFD? 90 minus x by 2. So, but we know that angle EFD equals to angle EDF because base angles are equal. That means 90 minus x by 2 is equal to 180 minus 4x. Simplifying, we will get 4x minus x by 2 equals to 90 degrees, 180 minus 90 or 7x by 2 equals to 90, x equals to 180 by 7. Approximately, if you are taking an integer value, so it is between 25 and 26, 25.7. If you are looking at 25, 30 in between, so you can take it as 25. If you are looking between 25 and 26, then you can take it as 26. Exact value you want, it is 25.7 approximately. So, the concept what we have used to solve this interesting problem is that in a triangle, all the angles will add up to 180 degrees. The exterior angle is equals to sum of two opposite interior angles and also if two sides of a triangle are equal, then their opposite angles are equal. These are the three concepts we have used fundamentals to solve this interesting problem to find out that angle DAE equals to approximately 25.7.